look at these people. They're the same as you and me, but different. We have our unique lives, everyone does. That's what makes us normal. Hi, I'm Ellie Ariano. I'm anorexic. It was now summer before freshman year, and I grew obsessed with working out. I looked so confident, but on the inside, I hate myself. They called me a slut, a whore. I wasn't myself. I changed who I was. I wasn't that Ellie that everyone saw. I endangered myself with my own strength and sadness. Depression was written in cuts and blood on my wrists and stomach and legs. I broke down. One of my friends, or so I thought, took me out one night to forget about everything, make me feel better. That night, that one moment, that one second, it changed my life. I was sexually assaulted. That night changed who I was drastically. I wouldn't let people touch me because I thought I was weak and if anyone even tried to hug me, I would fall into a spiral of nightmares and scenes flashing through from that night. That one night created my disorder. I'm still in pain, insecure. I still hate myself. I just can't bring myself to say I love you and hug people and give affection, you know, like a robot. People told me I was an anorexic freak, an idiot for bringing myself to that point. I thought that that crime that happened, I thought it was all my fault. It wasn't. It wasn't my fault at all. That type of crime and threat is never your fault. I was scared to speak up. Don't be scared to speak out. Don't be scared to show you're hurting. Don't ever blame yourself for someone that hurt you. It was never your fault. It never will be. Please, don't get to my point. <laughs>